time for Potentially Yours. It's Tuesday. We try to give uh, pets of the Dane County Humane Society a new place to call home. Gail is here with Blue. Blue. He's my boy. <laughs> he's a handsome dog. And he is a Weimariner. He's about seven years he's old. He's a who? Weimariner. Okay. Yes. That's a Wimey new one for me. or Weems, as Weimariner owners like to call him. And he is a handsome big dog. And he has kind of a unique story. He was surrendered to the shelter. The family had him, loved him, but he just wasn't get. Oh, look at that face. Yeah. He wasn't getting along with the other dog in the household, and so they just had to make a tough decision. And so, unfortunately, they mm -hmm. had to surrender Blue, but they said he was a great dog, but he would probably do best as the only dog in a home. Okay. And we also did a cat test, and he wanted to play a little too rough with the cats. And so, <laughs> but um, he's very smart, and I want to show really quick, Blue, let's show how smart you are. Will you kind of get up? Sit up. Come on. So he does sit. Oh. He does shake. Good he's job. You do, do high that. five. High five, good job. And he goes all the way down. And he's house trained, very smart, smart dog that already knows a lot of fun tricks. So. Okay, okay. But he has a unique part of his okay. story too. And we found out when we got him that he's heartworm positive. Okay, what does that mean? Heartworm is something that dogs can get. It can be spread by a mosquito. There's actually a preventative that is a good reminder for people to make sure your dog is on heartworm preventative. But he already has heartworm, but what we want to do is start treatment. And treatment is totally possible. We want to try and help the owners um, do that. We actually provide the treatment, mm -hmm. but it's best to do that in a calm environment. They need to be staying in a, in a quiet, in a, mm -hmm. in a controlled, environment and at the shelter it's just a little too no, stressful. No, it's just too chaotic, I'm sure. And so we want to mm -hmm. find him a perfect home and we'll help talk the adopters through everything and um, it's just a series of, of, he has to get a couple injections and he just needs to stay calm and it's about a month long process. Um, and then done. And then he's fine, yeah. So it's a something that's totally doable and he's such a great dog. He deserves that second chance and and he's a wonderful, he, he's going to be a great addition to any family. He just needs a nice, quiet home for, for a little time. And oh, what do you some. see, handsome boy? But he <laughs> rode so nicely. He was walking around with me so mm -hmm. nicely. And I'm, I'm a smaller person, and I could walk yeah. him so well. Okay. He's just handsome and polite. So we just need a, a good, solid yes, home for him. And boy. you'll provide the treatment for the heartworm. Yep, and we'll do, it's done. A month and so, done. Yep. Okay. And he will be, okay, <laughs> you got to turn very around good. here, baby. So he's a good right. boy. Okay. He's Gail, thank home. you. Thank, thank you. you very good much. Job. All right. If you are interested in adopting or checking out the animals at Dane County Humane Society, go to GiveShelter.org and set up an appointment. 8380413 As we head to a break here are two animals available at Green County Humane Society we'll be right back